A majority of citizens are not pleased with the level of utility services and reforms are necessary, said the head of the Lawyers' Confederation, MP Ali Hussainov. The Lawyers' Confederation, State Committee on the Struggle Against Corruption, and the Eurasia Foundation held public discussions on increasing transparency in utility services. Along with the state-run housing management office, private organizations also provide utility services. In 2009, a new housing code was adopted in Azerbaijan. This code creates opportunity for holding reforms in this area, said Samir Aliyev, head of Center for Public Initiatives. Reforms in utility services helps to eliminate corruption and improvement of the quality of the service. According to the deputy head of the State Committee on the Struggle Against Corruption in Amkerimov, electronic services should be applied to eliminate corruption and help citizens to obtain relevant information without having to rely on officials. The existence of housing management offices doesn't comply with the 2009 housing code adopted, said Samir Aliyev. There are three types of housing in Azerbaijan, private, state, and municipal. Utility services for all housing is provided by housing management offices, which were established in 1959, said Aliyev. According to the new housing code, provision of utility services must be operated by residence councils, private companies formed by residents or by cooperatives. According to the new housing code, if residents can create residence council within six months, the responsibility passes to municipalities. At present, the housing management offices collects 30 cents per square meter from every citizen and receives subsidies from the state budget. In 2012, 100 million manits will be allocated for housing management offices, an increase of 300%.